Oh, oh, oh my God! That wow, hurt. Joel's brutal. Oh, your fucking kneecap off. Ooh, he would do it too. Oh, fight, fight. oh my God! Oh, the town. What town? Hey everyone, I'm Andrea, this is Phil, we are the Kai Masters, and we're back to bring you our reaction to The Last of Us, episode 8. Oh my gosh, we're on episode 8 already, we're almost done this show, oh. That goes quick. It's been a journey, it's been a very, like an emotional roller coaster. Um, so Phil, give us a synopsis of what happened in the last episode. It was a pretty slow episode. We learned a lot about Ellie's backstory. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, it, just as a process of saving Joel, I guess. Yeah, the um, episode with her and Riley, or the flashback of her and Riley was very, uh, very sad. Um, I guess that was the first time she ever got bitten and got infected. Obviously, unfortunately, Riley didn't make it, but Ellie I get this. The memory was our their way of showing us that Ellie didn't has already lost somebody that she loves and cares about, and she doesn't want to lose Joel. So she looks like she found a sewing kit and stitched him up. What did you think about that? Do you think Joel's gonna make it? Oh uh, yeah, Joel's gonna be fine now. I hope so. Yes. Um, so I guess without further ado, let's go to episode eight. Just before we do that, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel. It really helps us out. We do have a Patreon, and the link is in the description. And we're very grateful for the patrons that we do have. We really appreciate your support, so thank you very much. I really hope Joel's okay. I wonder if we're gonna get any more heartbreaking memories. <laughs> yep, that's Canada in winter. And I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men. Looks like we're gonna have some new characters here. I wonder at what point this is. I've read this passage too many times. A flashback? Yeah, like is this in the past? Is this current? I don't know. I don't know. Do you remember what comes next? And God will wipe away all tears from their eyes. Neither will there be any more pain. For the former things are passed away. Hmm. When can we bury him? Her father, maybe? The ground is too cold to dig. We'll bury your father in the spring. I think this is the present, but... In another place. No, wouldn't there be walls and guns and... Hmm. This feels in the past to me. How much do we have left? Venison, elk, rabbit. Hmm. Maybe not. No. Current. <laughs> it might be the same community that Tommy and weak. Maria. I don't think so. Two at best. James, I sense doubt in there. I haven't lost faith in you, David. You're just scared. Not from them. I still believe. But I need to know, you're with me. Now go get our guns. We're going hunting. Wonder how this links with the Joel and Ellie's story. I'm sure we'll find out. Maybe they encounter them. Maybe Joel and Ellie are on their way to this community. Man, he looks rough. Hope he's gonna make it. Of course he's gonna make it. I know, but it doesn't he doesn't look great. When's the last time he ate anything? Must have been a while. I'm gonna be right back, okay? Wonder how many days they've been in there. Two or three? Oh, she's going hunting. Wow. I bet she's a good hunter. Aw. Aw. That bunny's so cute. That bunny is food. I know, it's tragic. Oh. 
Shoot. Not so easy. Rabbits would be hard to hunt. They're so fast. How would she bring back a wolf deer? I don't know. Don't shoot it. She's starving. I know, but... Oh, it's so pretty! Oh, shit. Oh, she heard it and didn't get it. That's the worst case scenario. And now it's gonna die slowly. And she's gonna starve. That's literally the worst thing that could have happened. Oh, yeah, that deer... It might not get far. Oh, well, it's not long for the world. Well, I don't see anybody. You think we can just take it? Oh, shit. She's gonna lose it. Drop your rifles! <sighs> now! Good for her. She's probably gonna share it with them, though. Turn and face me. Slow. <laughs> Look at their faces! You're quite a hunter. We didn't even hear you coming. Turn around and walk away. My name is David. This is my friend James. Well, even so, you can't drag this back on your own. Yeah, exactly. We're mm -hmm. not asking for charity. We, we can trade you. Medicine? Like for infections. Buddy boy can go get it. He comes back, you get half the deer. Anyone else shows up, I put, I put one, one right, right between... between my eyes. I love her so much. All right, mm -hmm. Go talk to Howard. He's got a case with some penicillin. It's not code, James. Do as I said. <laughs> it's not code. <laughs> he could screw them over. Like, he could come back with five guys and guns. Like, he could, but Jen Ellie's gonna shoot David. They could sneak up on her. Ten steps back. It's dangerous. That's all I'm saying. Keep going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that poor deer. Yeah, I'm kidding. Nature is brutal. Oh. That's not nature. Well, I know, but it's... He wasn't killed by another animal, he's killed by humans. Yeah, but they're survi They're trying to survive. Yeah, which you is... really shouldn't be out here all on your own. From where I'm sitting, you shouldn't be out here on your own. <laughs> Fair enough. Ellie's awesome. She is. So, and for what it's worth, there's room for you in our group, if you want. You're inviting me to your hunger club? Thanks. <laughs> hunger true. club. We're hungry, but we're still here. Yes. They chose to follow you. Is this some weird cult thing? Uh, well, <laughs> you sort of kind of got me there. I am a preacher, but just pretty standard Bible stuff. So you went from teacher to preacher because what, it fucking rhymes? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> but seriously. Well, I found God after the apocalypse, which is either the best time or the worst time to find him. Hard to say. Well, your luck had to run out sooner or later. Hmm? Luck? There's no such thing as luck. No, I, I believe everything happens for a reason. <laughs> it does. Nothing will grow. The game's been hard to find. So I sent four of our people to a nearby town to, to scavenge what they could. And only three of them came back. And the one that didn't was a father. He had a daughter just like you. And her dad was taken from her. Turns out he was murdered by this crazy man. That crazy man was traveling with a little girl. You see? James, lower the gun. Oh, they did ambush her. She is the one that killed Alec, didn't she? She didn't kill anybody. Did you bring the medicine? Yeah, but... Throw I... it to her. Back away. I know you're not with a group. You won't survive for long out there. I can protect you. Doesn't she get some of the deer? She doesn't trust them anymore, so she'd rather just go with the medicine. Oh. Ellie got screwed, if anything. Yeah, no, well, medicine for the deer. Well, I'd take at least half the deer. That was the original deal. I would have asked for the deer. Is it real medicine though or did they get did she get scammed? Oh geez. Maybe looks better? I don't know. Joe, where the fuck do I put this? Good question. I would have no idea. I thought pen 
do you shoot penicillin in? Well, this is liquid form. Yeah. Oh, I hope it's... I hope she knows what that is. She could be putting poison in this body. No, I'm sure it's penicillin. Why? Wow. Because they're not going to kill off Joel, but it, it could be anything. Technically, that guy could have sabotaged them. It's every man for themselves. Aww. She's starting to love him. Only five more left. What is it? Venison. Big one. They don't look impressed. <laughs> yeah, what is going heard on a rumor. here? Yes, we found a girl who was with the man who took Alec from us. When the sun rises, I'll lead a group out to pick up her trail. Won't be hard to find in the snow. Jeez. We'll follow it to wherever they're hiding. You should kill him. You should kill both of them. What? What's wrong with this guy? It is a cult, but it's not religious. This guy is the worst. I know you think you don't have a father anymore. But the truth is, Hannah, you will always have a father. And you will show him respect when he's speaking. <laughs> I hate this guy. Ellie should have shot him. Yeah, I'm kidding. And not in a place that would kill him instantly. Thank you. So is there really venison they're eating? Because the way she asked and the way he answered... Yeah. Seemed weird, didn't it? And then they dragged the deer in after, oh, so... Is food. Yeah, that doesn't look very good, whatever it is. And they weren't impressed when he brought the deer in, so... I don't really know where this is going. Look how much food he has compared to everyone else. He's the cult leader. Be careful, Ellie. Is she gonna see them coming? I have no idea. She was tipped off by the birds flying away. Oh shit, is that them? I think so. If this man's not already dead, he's dangerous. About the girl. We bring her back with us. Joel, Joel, wake up. Joel, wake the fuck up, Joel. Oh, he's somewhat awake. What's she gonna do? Oh. Okay, there are men coming, okay? I'm gonna lead them away from you. But if anybody makes it down here, you fucking kill them. You got it? No. He Joel. doesn't really look like he's Don't hearing you not anything. Fall asleep. I don't think he could kill anyone right now. No, he doesn't look great. He's just gonna go back to sleep. Yeah, if those men come down, he's in trouble. So they just followed her footsteps. Hey, motherfuckers! <laughs> oh, I don't know that she should be shooting. Yeah, that's a little dangerous. But if they shoot back? Well, they will. They're not sure if they want to save her or bring her back or what. Keep coming, fuckers. <laughs> What's her plan? Oh! I got her! I can eat the horse. Oh, shoot. She doesn't look good. Do it. No, don't. David doesn't want to kill her. That fall must have really knocked her out. Two of you with me. Drag the horse. The rest of you, stay here, go door to door. You so hungry for vengeance? Deliver it. So what does he want with Ellie? Just to initiate her into the cult? Maybe. 
you know what cult leaders do with some of their younger female oh yeah no i don't want to know <laughs> she's a little kid that's yeah Show us dark, man. It, nothing good happens in it. No, well, I mean, Ellie and Joel are still alive for now. That's about the only good. Oh, shit. Wake up, Joel. Wake up. Well, she put that thing in front of the door. Maybe he won't see it. Somewhat awake. There, see? The door's behind that. Mm-hmm. Oh, he does see it. Yeah. As I said, these guys are not stupid. <laughs> The survival instinct is kicking in. Oh, good. You get him, Joel. Oh, Joel half dead is still better than this guy. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Oh. Whew. The others are going to come, though. Wow. How did he muster that much strength? Must have been penicillin. Mm-hmm. Let me help. Well, that's certainly the goal. You're a dangerous person. You've certainly proven that. Did you hear me say the others want to kill you? But I stopped them. Fuck you. <laughs> Why don't we just start with your name? Eat shit. Hey, listen to me. <laughs> you can't survive on your own. Right, your friend. And how is he? I can see how much you care about him. So I know it hurts. That part of your life, it's ending. And what I'm offering you is a beginning. But if you can't find a way to trust me, then yes, you are alone. Why would she trust him? <laughs> Oh, nice. <laughs> Joel looks okay now. Yeah. Oh. Leave him alone. Oh. You're next. Oh. 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 Jesus. Oh my God. That oh. Hurt. Joel's brutal. Oh, no, no, no. You. you focus right here. Oh. Or I'll pop your fucking kneecap off. Ooh. He would do it too. Oh, fuck! Fuck! Oh my god. Oh, the this... town! What town?! Silver Lake. Oh! oh. Uh, is he gonna kill uh, him anyways? Uh, uh. And where your resort is. And it better be the exact same spot your buddy points to. <laughs> Go ask him, he'll is he tell you the truth. I'm not lying. Oh, oh no. Joel. No! Why the fuck did you do that? He told you what you wanted. You motherfucker, fuck you. I ain't telling you shit. It's okay. No. I believe him. No. Oh. Oh, wow, the Joel. Yeah, that is brutal. That is a sight I haven't seen of Joel. Holy shit. I mean, we heard the rumors, but... What does she see? I don't know. Oh. Would you eat that? Well, if I was starving, I guess. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's a human ear. Oh, yeah, see, it wasn't venison. It's where they cut up the... Oh. It, that was, it was probably yeah, Alec or whatever. Oh. For what it's worth, this so is they're cannibals? Me, I swear. Oh, gross. You're gonna chop me up into little pieces. I'd rather not. If you want to judge me... Judge you? You're eating people, you sick fuck! <sighs> wow, she never loses her spirit. There are only a few of us that know. But I would have told you. Mm -hmm. Sooner or later. I guess sooner. I don't think your friend would either. Didn't he take another man's life to save yours? He was defending himself. He was defending you. But you knew that. You remind me of me. You're a natural leader, you're smart, loyal, violent. Hmm. I guess he hasn't met Joel. But I do. If I let you out of that cage right now, put that knife of yours in your hand, you'd stick me in a second. 
And I struggled with it for a long time. Until he found then God. Then the world ended and I was shown the truth. Right. By God. Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. By cordyceps. What does cordyceps do? Is it evil? No. It's fruitful. It multiplies. It feeds and protects its children. It loves. Why are you telling me all of this? This guy's insane. Because you mm -hmm. can handle it. They need a father. You don't. You're beyond that. What does he want with her exactly to make her a... I'm a shepherd surrounded by sheep. And to make her a leader? And all I want is an equal, a friend. I hope he doesn't want her as like his wife or... What about my friend? I can tell the others to stop looking for him. They'll spare him. They'll so just let him go? Mm, don't yes. trust him. They do what I tell them to do. They follow me. Yeah, well, they're dead. Three of them, at least, yeah. Well, us. the three he left behind. Think of what we could do together. As strong as we are. Imagine the life we could give them. Don't touch him. Imagine the life we could build. Ooh. I'm sorry. I hate this guy. Oh, God. Yeah, he's disgusting. Break his fingers, Ellie. I guess she has to play along with him. Oh. Ow! Yes! Ow! <laughs> yes! <laughs> she did what I told her. Oh, shit. Ellie. What? Why are you telling him Tell her name? Tell him that Ellie is a little girl who broke her fucking finger! <laughs> How did you put it? Hmm? Tiny little pieces? Well, he like broke her nose or knocked her teeth out. Oh. oh, Joel, man. This is one of the most brutal episodes by far. Oh, that's the horse. Mm hmm. Oh. I knew something bad was going to come of the horse. Oh, those are people. Yes. Oh. Shit. Oh, wow. oh, what are you gonna do to her? No. Oh. oh, God. Wait, 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 wait. What do they have in mind? Oh, and now, so are you. Oh, oh. Sleeve, look at it. Look at it. Why did he miss like that? Now she would have turned by now. This isn't real. That looks pretty fucking real to me. <laughs> that was good for her. Wow. Oh my god. Well, how did he miss from that close? Yeah. He's a shitty marksman. Is she gonna run into Joel? Or he's in a different building. Oh. That guy deserves to die. Yes. They all do. David especially. David is the worst. Oh, Ellie. Oh, yeah, that's not great aim. At least they're gonna start in a fire. That's not a bad idea. Well, is Joel in that building? No, I think it's in a different one. I hope so. Ellie? Pretty good signal Ellie! to Joel, though. Joel will know where they are now. Mm hmm. It's the house that's on fire. And shoot this I know asshole. You're not infected. No one infected fights this hard to stay alive. So, how did you do it? You don't know how good I am! You don't know what I could have given you! Well, Get I have news for you. That's burning fast. Neither one of it's us is dying good. today. You see, I've changed my mind. Mm. I decided you do need a father. So I'm going to keep you. And I'm going to teach you. Ellie. Help! Oh! Oh! Shit! Fuck! Joel needs to get there fast. Oh! Oh! I thought you already knew. The fighting is the part I like the most. Oh, what a 
free. Don't be afraid. <laughs> Get him. <laughs> Get the gun. Yeah. All right. And then get the fuck out of there. Okay. Good for him. Yeah. Wow. Okay, Ellie, I think he's dead. You might want to run. Oh. What a scene. Holy crap. Wow, I would try getting out of there, no? She'll be fine. I know, but... Oh. Are there any more of them out there? to rip your heart out. No, what was Well, no, that was I mean that great. that was nice. Yeah, but Wow. I teared up a bit there. Okay, yeah, that's the end. Wow. Um yeah, that was I don't know why I teared up there. I'm a bit of a wimp. Um wow, that was quite the episode. That was very violent, very scary. Um wow. Um thoughts Phil? That's a really good episode. Man, I actually really enjoyed that. I think that, that guy was such a creep. Oh, David, yeah, he deserved everything. And then seeing it. Ellie get the best of him and mm -hmm. hacking him to pieces. That was yeah, that was great. Wow. She didn't even need Joel's help. She did it herself. That's amazing. That's incredible. But um, I do have one question or one thing I was wondering about is David's arm showed. Did Ellie bite him? Because his arm showed that he looked like he was infected. No, they were looking at Ellie's arm. Well, I thought David... I thought at one no. point David pulled his... Well, I know no. Ellie had her arm all messed up, but... Right. She said to David, you're infected. Right, okay, so that's the question. Ellie said that because Ellie bit him, mm -hmm. he showed his hand and it, there was a bite mark there? Because yes. Ellie bit him. Oh, yeah, okay. When, so when they came into the cell to get her, they were wrestling with her and Ellie bit down on his hand. Okay, that was it. And so then Ellie said... I'm infected. And so are and you. Now, so are you. Yes. Okay. So that's the question. Can Ellie actually infect others? I'm assuming not. I think she was lying. Yeah, she was, I think. I don't think yeah. she can infect others. But... but still, it was effective. Yeah. Well, David, yeah, David saw his hand and freaked out, which is understandable. And uh... but no, David read her right. He said, um, nobody infected fights this hard to stay alive. Okay. But yeah. he read her right. He, he, he knew that she wasn't. He knew something was going on. He knew that in some in some way she wasn't sick. She wasn't mm. going to get. Okay, yeah. No, they they were very smart. Um, they were at jerks, obviously, but they were very smart. Um, fortunately, Joel mustered up the strength to take care of them. And of course, Ellie is a, a natural born fighter. So David was right about that. Um, I think he was trying to make her his wife. I oh, think, for sure. Yeah. Like her. Yeah. So they would co-lead together. But, yeah, which means he's probably also did that with that girl he slapped. Oh, yeah, that's so creepy. He was probably also doing it to her. They're both kids, like, oh. Yeah, okay. but that's what cults are like, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. some of them. Mm, yeah, that looked like just a normal religious service at first. But yeah, that was... Okay. Guy's... Yeah, he's insane. I'm glad he's done. Um, I did not feel... That was one death I did not feel sad about. Um, what are you... So the finale is next. What are you expecting for the finale? I don't know. Like, is, I don't know, are they going to get to where they're going? Or, I, I have no idea <laughs> with this show. They're very standalone episodes, hey? In each episode, you meet new people, and it ends. Like, it actually ends. So it's like stories within a story. Yeah. I mean, you have the, the master narrative of Ellie and Joel traveling across the country, right, but, but within each one, you have a little story. Every episode so, yeah. is standalone. Yeah. yeah, I love the way they've it's done really that. good. I'm really enjoying it, so... Yes, me too. Um, and we just have... Oh, so what was that episode? Okay, that episode was called When We Are In Need. Mm -hmm. It has an 8.3 rating. What? That's low. Sorry, 9.3. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Okay. Maybe I should redo that. <laughs> that episode is called When We Are In Need. It has a 9.3 rating. Okay. Wow. Yeah, no, that's... Uh, yeah, that's apt. That definitely was a powerful episode. 
I don't know which one. They're all... So many of them are so good. I mean, episode three with Bill and Frank, and then episode five with Sam and Henry, and then this one. Yeah, this is the second highest rated episode, so... Wow, okay. I don't know if it would be my second favorite, but it was up there. It was. Yeah, it was violent. I was into it the whole way. I got it. Yeah, me too. It did. It's like, how how is Ellie gonna get out of this? Yeah. Is Joel gonna save her? Is yeah. Joel gonna survive? What's what are David's intentions? Yeah. Yeah. He's just a creep. But I think you could tell fairly early on he was not quite right. Yeah. But um, anyway. like right from the, the very first scene in the episode is him reading a passage from the Bible, and so right away I think. Well, I mean, this guy might be a nut. Well, I mean, it's, he's a a priest or a pastor or whatever. I forget what he called himself. Yeah, but just, I think, if you think post-apocalyptic, someone preaching, reading from scripture, you know, those guys always turn out to be crazy. Not necessarily. I mean, what I thought... In a post-apocalyptic world, yes. No, what I thought when I first saw David is he's just, uh, he's trying to rebuild a community, and church is part of what makes a community, um, or made a community before the apocalypse. So okay. he's just trying to rebuild that um, into the community. Okay, well, you're naive then. <laughs> okay, I guess I am. Uh, anything else? I guess. No, I, I just I want to get to the finale. <laughs> okay, we'll see you in the finale. See you then.